Hello, YouTube. We are back. Killing it. And killing it. And killing that. Killing that. Killing that. Killing all the things. Uh, university would be good for one of our Eurekas. I wish I could declare a special war. Just can't. And let's reposition before we go deeper into war things. Like the housing alone from Haciendas, most tile improvements do not give you housing. And so the fact that you get a half is huge. I may. I actually probably should make peas here. And let him flip to me. Yeah, I probably should. I don't want to, like, lose cities. Plus, he'll give me all his stuff. It's pretty great. Nay. All right, peace, peace in our time. We are benevolent. Let's swing everybody down and around. Full reverse. Shooting arrows at both feels funny. It is kind of funny. It is kind of funny, isn't it? All right, so Vamp Castle here. Chop these things and then more Vamp Castles. Yeah, the fact that you can just stack them next to each other is so powerful. Let's get on our knees. So Niter is a small bottleneck. to be expected. Although when you have this many troop or er, uh, cities, it's a little surprising. Yeah, a couple barbs up there, to be sure. Oh, 
Posey, man. I'm telling you. It's a very good tile improvement. Clear that, I guess. Not being super diligent with uh, governors. Am I going to Twitch Continent Vegas? No, I can't really afford it this year, unfortunately. Uh, but maybe in future years again. We, I went to one. I went to I went to TwitchCon in twenty nineteen, but it was kind of it'd be more fun to go now because I have a lot more like friends in the streaming community. So it would be, like, actually enjoyable. Versus last time, it was just kind of a couple of us. And it, it was it was still good. It was still fun. But, um... Yeah, Haciendas are starting to feel a little spicy. We're pushing... Pushing hard. I really want to get here. Because the this bonus is what? Re replaceable parts. So it's, yeah. So each of these plantations will be better food. Have I been to Vegas before? Yeah, I've been to Vegas once, and I'm actually going to Vegas again. I, I will weirdly be in Vegas right before TwitchCon, uh, but for a totally different reason. Not right before, like a month before. But I'll be there later on this month. It's on your bucket list? It's like, meh. It's, I, I, I don't, I don't like Vegas for a lot of reasons. Um, it it's just very, very like crass and predatory to me. Um, like it's just, they, um, like they oxygen, ox oxygenate the air <laughs> so that you're like happier. Like, I just, I, like that feels real cringe to me. I don't like that. Um, so I, I, I don't know. It's just not really for me. Like blackjack. See, I don't I don't really get a lot of joy out of gambling. Like I love playing um I love playing like poker with my buddies or whatever, you know. Like I, I very much enjoy that. Um But like I don't I don't really get a lot of pleasure out of out of like gambling per se. I don't have anything against it. I, I just it's just not like my thing. And prostitutes. <laughs> Go see, see, see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Poker with your friends is fun. Poker in Vegas is trying to steal your money. It's, it's exactly it, right? Like the house always wins, and I just I can't unknow that. Um So. L wife loves the killers, saw them last time. Oh yeah, the killers are great. I also like the killers. But yeah, so I don't know. Vegas is okay. I just, I, I was there once and I was there probably slightly too long. And I just don't have a strong desire to go back. Although, again, I will be there later, uh, later this year, so or later this month, rather. You are blocking my spot. You're blocking my egress. Found out you're going to be a grandpa for the first time in March next year. Yo, Red. Congrats. That's awesome. I love hearing that. Thank you for sharing. Super cool, my friend. Congratulations. 
listening to anything. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. What do we want? It's fine for now. Trying to siphon my funds. Oh my god, with the barbs. So many barbs. Maybe not. Because we're only 20, that's alright. My brother started having kids around that age. I have the killers in my head. It's a really interesting Huey. And it goes next to my theater square? Wow. Brilliant, actually. I mean, it's slightly better. Whatever. Thank you Three for the years. 36 Woo months. Smiley face. Hello, hello. How you doing? Great to see you. Thank you so much for the ongoing support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Is my brother an utter moron, though? Your son is? No, my brother is. Uh, no, my brother is, 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 is not at all a moron. He's a well-planned, well-thought-out kind of fella. He's got a, a good job. Good job. But if you get an early start on it, he, he turned it into five kids. So that's impressive. And I feel like Norway is still mad at me. Do you guys think we'll ever have real peace? Or is it going to be catty and standoffish? They're mad at me either. It's weird. Youngish grandparents are a blessing. I can see that. into a hacienda. episode called Moving Your Troops. Brother. 
I was trying to make 10 settlers by turn 100. <laughs> That's pretty great. Yeah, that sounds about right. That may never fully loyalty flip to me. I guess I don't care. We have so many cities now. Managing them is frankly tedious. So where should the other vamp castle go? Could go here. I think I like it. No, the Uber tile is the vamp castle. And you can't actually work it. What I think is the best secret society for a tall game? I mean, if you can hit with those uh, ley lines, I could see that being really good for tall because you could just get more out of your districts. But it's just such a variable, you know? So I don't know. There's just not a lot of stuff that plays so plays well with tall, you know? Maybe vamps? Yeah, vamps, honestly, just because of the castle. I could see that. I could definitely see that. Trying out the CYP wide and tall mod. Interesting. I know nothing about that. This will be our final vampire castle. Yeah, yeah, they, they're all, they're, there's an argument for, like, all of them being decent, but none of them are, like, designed for it, right? Like, all of them kind of are double-edged swords, because they, they, they just simply get better as you um, get, get wider. It's just how most of the mechanics work in this. Petra is a brilliant claims that what I like about it. Unfortunately, Nazca has some of my tiles, but again, this isn't that kind of a game necessarily. Also, I need way more builders. There's Kamiko, so Kamiko can start. And we'll have Kamiko start down here. We'll get some upgrades. We got a good amount of money, so we can buy upgrades and units. It's mostly just trying to hit a bigger 
government here. Let's do that. And then let's do some upgrades. I think. Pretty fun so far. Add specific Diplo cards, so if you work in cities with 22 pop, pop or you have seven fear. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that those are the, that's those are like neat ways of, of looking at that. I dig it. I dig it. Freaking Zanzibar. Yeah, again, I, I would like more reasons to play tall. So that, that's appealing to me. I want to use all our money, but I need a couple builders over here just to fix things up. And then we're almost back to having our vamp castles updated, so that's fantastic. This is another fine vamp castle. It's not amazing. Similar to the other one. What's this general? This is medieval renaissance. So this is still relevant. And then there's Himiko. So we're about ready to get that started. Victor with promotions down here. I don't know how to get the promotions. Hey, Luce, how's it going? Promise you keep spawning on a map where you have no neighbors and all the rooms that you just want to keep settling? Yeah. Luce, thank you for the 59 months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome on back. Excellent to have you here. Appreciate it greatly. So own two banks and then we're triple line infantry. Where's my line infantry?
don't know to, if we should take over Mohenjo or not. It seems like it might not be worth it at this stage. That'd be cool, Darmok. I'd, I'd love to see that actually fleshed out. The idea being, if you declare on a single unit, you wouldn't necessarily... You could, like, kill a single unit, like, assassinate a single unit. That'd be either a cool Civ ability or just Civ 7 mechanic, in my opinion. Right? Like, that'd be super neat. I like the idea a lot. So how am I supposed to get Victor promos? These two? Interesting spy ability. That'd be cool too. Yeah. All other lands that would work. Found on the western oh, that's how I get my governor promotions. Derp. All right. So now, two turns, we can buy units and then get going. Guys, a unit belonging as an enemy. That'd be really fun to just like put like a mustache. Or like stack stack a three stack three units in a trench coat. I think that'd be fun. Oh yeah, I put in Diplo League, didn't I? I did. So we declare on Monty. We will go to war with Mohenjo. That's our opportunity to take him out. Don't super care what's happening with these things. Combine these. I realize that I'm spending money, but I'm trying to get to our break point before the vampires get there. Remember that policy. Hmm. That might be a good reason to start the war.
could be down with that. mobilization two field cannons is very doable we'll have that shortly that seems good bigger government please way too much of my money. Classic. Classic me. Spending it like it's going out of style. Alright, I think it's time to move down. I think we will wind up killing Mohenjo, even though they don't have a settler anymore for me. But they're just going to kind of be in the way. I could save some envoys for containment. That seems all right. Be friends forever. Kill a unit with a knight just isn't happening anymore. He waited till I moved my troops. He did. He really did. That was dastardly. improved. Uh. 1100 for that. Itch has returned. Yeah, you know what? It was nice just kind of recognizing, like, oh, I think I'm a little, I think I need a little break from this. And then kind of taking it and feeling better about things. Who knew? Who knew that could be a thing? I certainly didn't. How you doing, Imperator? It's good to see you, bud. Now. Sure. I have reasonably happy cities, all things considered. What 
But it always does. It's an itch that doesn't go away. Not forever. Too great of a game to avoid? Agreed. Agree with that wholeheartedly. But sometimes you need a break, and that's okay. gonna be able to get to this before we want to redo our vamp castles but we're right there this time. That was my first bombard down here okay We should get in uh, pillage policies again now. Put in raid. Sorry, total war. But there's a good triangular trade is not. Let's take amenities now. And be relatively happy with this. Nothing else I like that for vision. <laughs> Rip all my trade routes. Hello, friend. Hello, who's that? Van Bradley. Hey, buddy. How you doing? What goes on? BB with 39 months. Thank you so much. How's life treating you? How are your, um, you know, things? Good, I hope. Dominate. Yes, dominate indeed. Indeed, indeed. Life is great, busy, can't complain. I love all that. That's, those are all good things. Seemingly, anyways. Yeah, things are great with me, man. Thank you very much. Thank you for the ongoing support. Mace, thank you for the 49 months. That's incredible, too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Very much appreciate. Oh, he's got the ability. Oh. 
this. Yeah, man, it's so, so good to see you. I miss you when you're not around. Sometimes I miss you when I'm not around. Probably just builders. Traders are good too. All right, can we get these vampire castles going? We're so close. I need science. Sweet Lord, can we not? He isn't a heroic, so it's going to be a little bit tricky. How close are we to principal parts? We could just do it and redo it. What you doing that, dude? He was having a good time. He was. He was having a good old time. I don't begrudge him his good times. But they are required to stop. Any more builders? Alright, the quest for more builders continues. We can finally kill Mohenjo for their transgressions against us. And uh, and then we'll be back. We'll be back with more of this bonkers sieve. I, I'm not talking about it enough, but Grand Columbia is so strong. Um, I understand that the Haciendas don't look insanely good but they really are like that's a that's that's food that's production that's gold that's housing like it's just perpetual top end uh which is so so nice so thanks youtube thanks for watching twitch.tv slash the game mechanic join us live in person see you then